Okay, in this problem, we're asked to find a continuously differentiable parameterization, x, y, z equals r of u, v of the surface, and determine if it's a local regular parameterization. So our surface is z equals x squared plus y squared. Um, we want it an r of u, v. So we want three components in terms of u and v. We know that z is equal to x squared plus y squared. So we can just let x equal to u, y equal to v, and then plug in for our z component, which is u squared plus v squared, using our new um, terms for x equals u and y equals v. So this is a pretty good parameterization. Let's see if it's local regular. Um, so let's take the partial derivative of r with respect to u. We get 1, 0, 2u. And R with respect to V is 0, 1, 2 V. Okay, so now we want to find, so if, if R is regular, then that means that there are only, that the only terms A and B such that this statement is true is when a is equal to 0 and b is equal to 0. So we want to see if we can find some term a and b such that they're not both 0 and this equation is satisfied. So first looking at this, we see that um, of our, our vector multiplied by b, the first component is 0. So that means the first component of a is the only term that will count towards the first term of this, which is 0. So that implies that a is 0. And similarly, b is the only term that um, is going to be affecting the second component, which also needs to be 0. So that implies that b equals 0, which tells us that it's local regular because a equals 0 and b equals 0. So we found a parameterization of our surface, and we also determined that it's local regular parameterization.